Hello friends, welcome back to All in One Law and this is a medical video lecture, Microbiology and today's topic of dis discussion is Moraxella Moraxella Cateralis Okay, so I'm going to talk very briefly because it's not so much important for you assembly step on examination. So before starting a discussion, I would request you to subscribe to our channel and please do share our videos with your friends. So try to remember about the points about the Moraxella cateralis. They are gram negative. They are gram negative. They are diplococci. Diplococci. Okay. So once they are very close related to Neisseria family, Neisseria family. Okay. So what's about the reservoir of this? The reservoir of this is normal upper respiratory tract flora. Normal upper respiratory tract flora. Okay. What's the transmission? Definitely, when it's present in the respiratory tract, it should be respiratory droplets okay what's the pathogenesis pathogenesis is by what do you call them um, guess tell me endotoxin or exotoxin hmm? it's e tell me yes it's endotoxin remember okay right okay what are the diseases it can produce it can produce the bronchitis very important bronchopneumonia in elderly patients Sinusitis, very important, otitis media. Okay, so how do you treat that? Is by amox and clavulanate combination that's known as augmenting, right? Yes, that's it. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Take care.